And hello from the English Midlands. This is the scene at Villa Park. I'm Derek Ray, and joining me here on the commentary box is Lee Dixon. And today could be a memorable day for the visitors, an opportunity for them to clinch the league title. It's Aston Villa, and they face Hull City. Well, what a chance these players have got to put their name up in lights, to make history. League championships don't come round very often. Don't slip up now. Well, you can probably see why we're focusing on this fellow as one to watch. Lee, in particular, what do you expect to see from his game? He's really hit form of late. The defenders are really going to have to watch him. Four goals in the last three matches. Here's how the lineup looks for Aston Villa. Would you call it 4 5 1, Lee? Yeah, I really like this formation, Derek. 4 2 3 1, really. The two central midfield players supplying support to a three ahead of them, and then a lone striker with a number 10 just behind him. Well, here's how the lineup looks for Hull City. Thank you, Villa Park. Enjoy the game. And so the battle commences. Sanson. John McGinn. A terrific defending to stop them progressing. Now oh, showing excellent vision. Can they convert? Well, he made sure there was absolutely no way through. And so, a look at the table, and while they have time on their side, with a win today, Lee, they'll be crowned champions. Yeah, absolutely, Derek. Get the job done. Today is the day. If you get a chance to be champions, you've got to take it. Don't rely on other days. Just get it done. What can they do from here? Oh, they've lost it. But they could run onto it here. Defensive efficiency personified. Powell. It's there for him. Sanson Samata on the ball still pushing for that goal that would see them forge ahead quick thinking to dispossess his opponent an awful lot of green space to run into Giving it a try, and putting his body on the line. Really good challenge. Samata. Petro Traore has it. Loves to attack from the wide areas. Well, couldn't keep it. We can get more details on that injury situation from our man pitch side, Jeff Shreves. Jeff? He landed really awkwardly on his shoulder there and he's in some discomfort. But he's a tough cookie. I think he'll stay out there. Cheers, Jeff. Can they take the lead? And in it goes! We can't say yet for sure, but it could be a title-winning goal. So important, that, Derek. Can they keep their nerve now? Drama. As we can see, right place at the right time. Striker's instinct is to be there or thereabouts. Keeper has no chance. 
So the match has restarted. 1 0 here. Constantinos for Tunis. Samata. McGinn. Losing possession here. Into the advanced position. Just cutting off the supply. Sanson. Well, the timing was perfect. Ball one. As you can see, the visitors haven't had too much of the ball. But when they've had the ball, they keep delivering the sucker punch. A great advert for low possession, counter-attacking football. It's really working. Well, nicely cut out. Now what can they do with the ball? A potential danger here. Well, clattered away. Well, there's the half-time whistle, and it's all going swimmingly. They're just 45 minutes away from being crowned champions today, Lee. Well, you just want to get it wrapped up, Derek, as soon as you can. You don't want to be relying on other games. As anticipated, plenty of talking points so far. And now the second half is underway. Sanson and unable to keep possession. Oh, that pass easy on the eye. That's all they can conjure for now. Constantinos for Tunis. I think most fans would be pretty happy with this man's display so far. And he might be through here. And it's gone in! And who knows, it could be the difference between winning the title and not. Well, it's almost too easy for them this season. Not easy anymore. There's certainly work to be done here. Can they do it? Not so sure, Derek. Moving forward effectively. Fairly comfortable in bringing that ball down. McGinn. The referee correctly decided to play advantage. Now, counter-attacking possibilities here. And possession given away. Must take the lead here. But it can't get through. Life is never dull in the championship. Live action coming up for you on EA TV. It's Aston Villa facing Norwich City. Yeah, that looks a great matchup, doesn't it? Looking forward to some fast-flowing football there. Well, not quite what he wanted to do with the pass. Jose. Angel Samata Harrison Superb defensive judgment to end the attack Stefan Oh nice ball Renato Stefan with it At times, they make passing look easy. And he has just fractionally misfired. Yeah, he should have put his laces straight through the ball. Sometimes he can get too cute. Nick Powell. 
promising attack this a reminder that foul and abuse no not the best challenge must be and in it goes we can't say yet for sure but it could be a title winning goal so important that Derek can they keep their nerve now drama what a big moment in the dying embers will it prove decisive here Sven Bender Sanson Aston Villa possession tick that box but after that it's been really disappointing players are looking at each other you've got to take control you've got to take responsibility yourself make something happen in this game and he's broken free Genghis Under there it is magical moment surely one hand on the trophy Lee History beckons. There's no way they'll throw this away now. So there it is. 3-1 the current scoreline here. Traore. McGinn. Fortunis has it. Alert defending. And five minutes to go. Oh, big chance. And a goal to settle the issue once and for all. Well, here's the replay. Super fast counter-attack football at its best. And he composes himself, coolly slides it past a lonely keeper who will be asking questions about where his back four went to. It's a massive lead, and it's very hard to imagine them losing it now. Traore. Fortunis has it. McGinn. And the referee has added on two minutes of stoppage time. Cash. It is a decent looking attack here. And that is that, the referee. There's the whistle, and the celebrations can truly begin in earnest now. They are the champions. Well, you worked so hard on and off the pitch for moments like these. And you can't say they don't deserve it. Been absolutely superb this season. They're going to enjoy this, and why shouldn't they? Well, the celebrations will continue long into the night. And don't forget, they'll receive the trophy at the next home game. Naturally, we'll have all the coverage of that live here on... Time for just a few questions. Thanks very much.